Here is a small Elenco Precision model number XR35 power supply. This is a 12 volt, 3 amp constant, 5 amp surge power supply. And this is just what I used to power my CB radio with. Uh, well, anyway, I went to flip it on the other day and it blew the fuse right away. And I actually saw some sparks coming out of the top. And so I went ahead and opened, opened it up today and sure enough, my fuse was gone. Um, I popped in a new fuse and it just blew that one right away which sucks because that was, that's my uh, last fuse of that value. But anyway, uh, once I saw that it kept blowing fuses, I immediately knew that there was something more wrong with it than just a bad fuse, obviously. So I'm making this video to uh, help you guide, uh, to uh, help guide you through uh, any future uh, power supply repairs that you might have that are similar to this. Um, usually the first thing I do is disconnect the power transformer. Now in my case here, with this power supply, the fuse comes after the power transformer, but in other power supplies, uh, for example this one I have over here, the uh, fuse is before the transformer. And in those cases, it's extra helpful, helpful to uh, disconnect the uh, power transformer from the circuit board in case the problem lies with the transformer. That way you, don't know, you know you don't have to go any further down the circuit. So if you disconnect your power transformer and your fuse is still blowing, then you know it's something wrong with the power transformer or something maybe in the power cord. But anyway, I went ahead and uh, disconnected my power transformer in this one anyway, even though the fuse is after the transformer in this circuit. And I went ahead and tested the voltage on the transformer and everything's okay. Next step is I uh, disconnect the uh, power leads that go to the front panel just in case there's maybe a short here from one of the positive posts onto this uh, grounded area here or something like that but that was okay and uh, no uh, there's no shorts here <clears throat> so after that I knew that this was a classic uh, bad uh, rectifier problem which is uh, it's a very, uh, I guess you could call it a common problem with uh, power supplies, and not just this power supply, but uh, many different types of power supplies. Um, blowing fuses constantly is a classic uh, telltale sign of uh, bad rectifiers. So I went ahead and disconnected one side of each rectifier here, and I tested them with the uh, diode checker. And sure enough, these two here, are conducting both ways which is obviously not what they're supposed to be doing and they, they need to be replaced so I'm gonna go ahead and replace those and uh, that should fix the problem okay so here's the uh, repaired power supply and there you can see the diode I replaced I made a mistake earlier by saying there was two bad diodes but there was really only one bad diode I don't know why I said two since I knew there was only one bad diode it was just a mistake I made when I was saying that Anyway, uh, yeah, you see a little patch in there, a little solder patch in there. That's because that diode is salvaged and the leads are too short. So I had to get a piece uh, of a lead from another diode to make it reach. And so that's why that little patch is there. Uh, and even though these diodes are salvaged, they're perfectly good. And that's why when I throw away something electronic, I always try and salvage as many parts as I can. Uh, back there is the uh, fuse. I actually managed to find another fuse of the correct value. It's a little bit too short for the holder, but it does snap in and it works fine. Um, over here on the meter you can see the voltage, 13.8 volts, which is perfect. The voltage was a little bit low, so I went in there and turned the trimmer to uh, bring the voltage back up. Uh, but anyway, yeah, there it is completed. I just got to put the, the uh, top back on and I hope this video helps you in case you have this uh, fuse blowing problem with any power supplies. Like I said earlier, uh, this applies to more uh, more power supplies than just, just this uh, type of power supply. Uh, I've had uh, this procedure help me out in uh, repairing LCD TVs and etc. So uh, hope uh, any of this information helps and uh, thanks for watching.